yeah, nice place. Cold. Just been up to that tourist cabin to have a coffee because there were two guys with uh, KTM 990s that uh, was on the same route as me and uh, you can ride the road in here. I don't know how long that is but I'm going to do that and uh, afterwards we're going to take this road that goes on this side of the fjord. That is 30 kilometers long. I don't know where that ends up, but uh, we will see. So, uh, ah, lots of great riding left. So, uh, now my phone is ringing, so I have to take that because I think that's my brother. <laughs> Yeah, it was my brother that called me. <laughs> He's on his way to a bike meet with his motorcycle club. But uh, I just had to tell him how beautiful is this up here. So now we're gonna push on. We're gonna go in that road. And we'll take that road a little bit later. But uh, yeah, let's see what this brings. Quite excited. <laughs> This is fucking awesome! There's the guys that I talked to. On the cafe, really nice. And uh, that KTM 990 is an awesome bike. <laughs> Here we have the end. Morbu coming up to now. Going to stop here. Not a bad place to stop. Look at that view. So, uh, Mor Vatne is the place that we're at now. This is the first time I'm up here and it's beautiful. And uh, I also got some other news. I reached a thousand subscribers. I was on holiday and suddenly it was a thousand subscribers. Now it's over a thousand subscribers, uh, but uh, oh, that's a milestone. So uh, congratulations, Thomas. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> but uh, I think that's pretty huge. Uh, I do this just because I like it and combine it with my motorcycle. So uh, thanks to all that have subscribed to my channel, sent me comments, everything. So, uh, and I checked what I've earned. 
the last three weeks and uh, that is uh, seven euros <laughs> so <laughs> you don't get rich but uh, that was not the plan either when I started doing this I just want to share what I do on the bike and uh, oh, look at these mountains yeah I don't regret going up here so uh, but now I'm going to take the other road, go down here again and take the other road. I think that was 30 kilometers long. And that's pretty long. And after that, head started heading back home again. But my wife said, just use, use the whole day. So <laughs> I think I'm going to use the whole day. But it was really nice to talk to those uh, chaps down at the cafe. One of them worked at the same industrial park that I work so uh, maybe I can contact him later about some tips because he had been on lots of trips in Europe on the TET we got some TET plans next year I think so uh, yeah let's head off again Got a GS, we got a GS, I think. Yeah, brand new 1300 GS with hard cases. <laughs> yeah, this is a nice little stretch. About, I think it's about 5 k's, 4 or 5 k's. But now we're going to take the road on the other side, and that is 30 k's, I think. Now I'm going to do this and see how far this goes. Hope the dam holds. <laughs> Just enjoy. But I know now that I got to get myself some other riding gear. Uh, I, got, I think I'll try to save some money and uh, buy me that same rabbit suit that my brother has bought because I need something that is a little bit lighter and, uh, I can keep this RST suit for touring <laughs> but I'm not going on these road kind of roads but, wow Not the most technical gravel roads, mostly hard pack, but uh, it's not tarmac. Some blind corners. And endless views. Oh, I'm enjoying myself so much now. All alone. I could have uh, ridden with the two other guys, but uh, I want to be alone today. And I'm faffing around with my cameras and everything, so... But uh, I want to enjoy this alone. Hopefully the weather can be like this next weekend, when I'm going on the tent. I know! My bike isn't sorted yet. <laughs> Gotta send an email next week and tell them how it how it is. <laughs> I need a new control unit. And, uh, hopefully they have come back to Skarna about my problem and that will be sorted pretty quick. But uh, next week and I have to... Uh, Go on the tent with these problems, but uh, I actually don't care anymore. <laughs> I do care, I gotta fix it, but uh, hopefully before winter 
Everything is sorted. Wow. <laughs> How many times have I said wow today? <laughs> Thank you, mates. I have to go all the way back too. <laughs> Whoa, double the fun. Yeah, but give this video a like. Subscribe to my channel and ding the bell and leave a comment. What do you think about this? I think we're going to get an awesome view up from here. That's what I call it, you. <laughs> this is Norway at its best. Look at this. Look at that. It's a fucking awesome view. I will stop here. Gee whiz! Look at that view! That is breathtaking! And uh, I'm enjoying my homemade lunch. And we're, and we're in the mountains in Norway. Get to have Norwegian bread with brown cheese. Mm -mm. Oh, that was good. There's a little bit of wind up here, but the temperature is pretty okay. I think it's 15, 16 degrees. And uh, mm. very enjoyable ride. Very enjoyable ride. So yeah. Leave a comment if you want. What do you think? I live in a beautiful country, don't I? And the road goes all the way over there. Now, enjoy some bread with brown cheese. Mm -mm. This is the most beautiful thing I've seen in a long, long time. That is massive! Just look at that. Massive. Give a like. Which way here? There's a road down there, isn't it? Nope. Yeah, there's a road down there. Does that go? I have to check out the map a little bit. <laughs> there's an old... I think there's a... I don't know what you call it in English. But uh, we will see when we get there. <laughs> it's a old... Uh, how, how do you say that in English? Gondol? This we gotta check out. And when you think you've seen all the highlights of the trip, this pops up. And uh, 
I would have turned around if that local guy hadn't told me this, but uh, we got a pretty awesome view here too. But uh, this is a gondol, isn't that what you call it in English? I think so. But this is closed because of renovation, and uh, but wow, just wow! Now I know what the mountain is called <laughs> that I've seen <laughs> for the last hour. <laughs> it's uh, Gaustadtoppen. <laughs> Me and my geography. <laughs> uh, but we have seen Gaustadtoppen all the way. Now we can really s take a good look at it. Uh, take a good look at it. And uh, yeah. So yeah, a very nice ride over the mountain. Enjoyed that. Now I have to go back, but uh, don't care. It's gonna be a lot of fun. So uh, taking you with me. Yeah. So let's make a U-turn and head back. So uh, I think we're gonna have a great ride out again. See the views from the opposite direction. And as usual, when I'm going out, it looks like rain. <laughs> That's the direction I'm going out when I'm coming down from here. <laughs> A 78 year old father he has been riding bikes as long as I can remember. He has bought himself a brand spanking new GS 1300 Enduro, and uh, <laughs> that's so cool. So, uh, I'm gonna try that bike out. It's a big, heavy German, but uh. I want to try that bike out. Is getting that bike next week, but when this vids come, comes out, it would have had it for a month or two. So looking forward to seeing that bike. But that means you're never too old to buy yourself a new bike. <laughs> I hope I can ride when I'm 78 years old. What a day, what a day, what a fabulous day! Some pretty awesome views, the opposite way too. <laughs> Sometimes you just have to stop and appreciate a very, very good view. <laughs> I said that a thousand times today, but uh, God smacked. That's the word I'm looking for. God smacked. appreciate life when you're riding in landscape like this. How do you say it? Glad to be alive. Oh hell yeah, I'm glad to be alive. <laughs>
just hop along and just enjoy the view again. It's nice. Again, nice. <laughs> but uh, it is very nice. Ooh. Give uh, this video a like, subscribe to my channel, ding the bell, leave a comment. Highly appreciated. But uh, if you're in these parts of Norway, you gotta come up here. Kalhovd. And uh, this is in uh, Telemark. And it's a stonker of a gravel road. The views. Today's top tip, Kalhovd. If you're in these parts of Norway. Oh, we gotta stop for beer, Thomas. What's the time? Quarter past three. Yeah, we can stop in uh, Ausbygde to have a buy a couple of beers. Hadn't imagined this today. I will do almost uh, almost 50 k's on gravel. A very good day, a very good day. So there's been no faffing today, I think. No, nah, no faffing at all. <laughs> a day without faffing. an awesome day I didn't expect this when I headed out on the bike today didn't expect it at all but I had an awesome time thank you for tagging along I hope you enjoyed it and uh, please leave a comment what you think and uh, if you like today's video give this video a like and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel and ding the notification bell my name is Thomas with a big grin on my smile <laughs> simple guy on two wheels see you next time people Bye.